Hello, my name is Andres Botero. I want to show you the work I have done on exporting from Blender to Unreal Engine 4 using the Datasmith format. Right now, the plugin fully supports exporting geometry and partially supports exporting materials, lights, and cameras. To use the plugin, you need to use the Blender 2.8 beta. Now, to install the plugin in Blender, go to the Edit menu, then go to Preferences, there go to the Add-on section, and then click the Install button. Select the zip file you downloaded and finally activate the add-on by clicking the checkbox. Now that it is installed, let me show you how it works. For this, I will be using the architectural visualization example from the Blender 2.8 website. After opening the file, open the file menu, go to export and then select Datasmith. Choose a location to export and then click the export button. After export, open Unreal Engine. Here I have an empty project. Just click Datasmith and then select the Datasmith file you exported. Now that the scene has been imported, let me guide you through the current features of the plugin. As you can see, all meshes match the meshes in Blender. Geometry, material slots, and UV maps are all correctly exported. Object transforms and parent hierarchies are also exported. Materials have some basic support. For example, here you can see how the chrome material is correctly exported, and the peer material loads the texture correctly. More complex node graphs just default to a white material for now. Lights are also supported. Apart from their transform, the light type, like point or spotlight, the size and the cone angle is correctly exported. Other properties are still missing, but will be implemented on a later stage. As you can see, cameras are also exported. For now, only their transform is used. Other properties of cameras, such as focal length or aspect ratio, are still missing. This concludes the Datasmith exporter presentation. I hope to be able to publish this soon, and I can't wait to see what you do with this. That's all I've got for you. Please let me know what you think about it. I really hope you liked it and thank you for watching.